Hi everyone, this is Marcia from our vintage store. Coming on today with uh, a little Christmas in July sale. I have been accumulating quite a bit of Christmas jewelry and I have more than I will wear in my lifetime. <laughs> so hopefully I'll be sharing some of this with you all. Um, this is what I have prepared so far. We are going to do a few pieces today. I'm going to do several small videos. We'll do 10 or 15 pieces today and then I'll do some more later. Um, but how this is going to work, I'm going to show you um, an item with one price on it, but I, I will make it clear in the description as well. But the price that I show you will be you can you can take an additional 10% off of that price right off the top. Um, so it's the price minus 10%. Um, this will be for YouTube viewers. Anyone in the United States, the 48 contiguous United States, will get uh, free shipping for orders $30 or more. I can't offer that to, to anyone outside the United States at this time. Um, but um, what I can offer is um, anyone that spends $50 or more, whether they're in the United States or outside the United States, will get an additional 10%. So that'll be like 20% um, like off if you spend $50. So you can look at it that way. So let's get started. <laughs> we'll start with this piece. This is an Avon candy cane lapel pen from the 1980s. So this one is vintage. Um, I will not take this, well I guess I could take it out of the package. I was going to say I was not going to take it out of the package at this time. Um, I think it's pretty, pretty easy to see what it is. But you know, in case, I'm not sure if that's right side or not but is that honestly I can't see it but I hope you did <laughs> it says Avon um, and it is enameled lapel pen um, let's see I'll take a quick measurement so it's about one and a quarter inches in length if that helps you out. So that will be our first item. That's item number one. It's the Avon lapel pen. Five dollars but like I said it'll be 10% off of that so 450. Okay so that is number one. Number two is also Avon. These are Avon pierced earrings, and I, I'm calling these Christmas, but they're wintry with the snowflakes. So you, they're not, it's not just for Christmas time, but they have the snowflake dangles and the ball stud. And I don't know, I don't believe these were marked Avon, but I did my research and they, I found several that. We're listed as Avon, so, or maybe, no, I don't believe the posts were marked, but these are Avon. Five dollars, so it would be four fifty for the pair, and that is item number two. Okay, we're on an Avon run. <laughs> Number three, item number three is also Avon, and these are rather heavy. Um, they have the rhinestones. Let's see, so we can measure this. Okay, they're about without the little uh, stand. Well, with the little stand, they're about an inch and an eighth, one and an eighth. Well, almost, almost a quarter. But they're they're rather substantial. Uh, all the rhinestones are there. These may be marked Avon on the back. No, 
they're not, but they are Avon. I have done my homework, I have done my research. Now these, I put new backs on because um, the backs that were that came with them, if they had backs, I'm trying to think if they even had backs. If they either didn't have backs or they were the backs were pretty bad off. But um, and these have a little bit of weight to them. So they wouldn't be suitable for children, that's for sure. But they are Avon, and uh, number three, I'm, it's $10. So if you take the 10% right off the bat, they're $9 for, for the pair. Okay, if I hold them still, you might be able to get a better look at them. Very nice earrings. All right, that is three. So number four is I have on my paper Christmas tree brooch 1970s obviously this is not a tree this is a wreath <laughs> but I must have found this and just wrote tree instead of, but it's in my paperwork but this is um this is a brooch This is enamel. This is gold tone. All right, there we go. Um, this is a gold tone brooch with the um, green and red enameling. Um, I like the holly leaves. Gold bow. Has that arched bar in the back, which would indicate that it's older but my research shows that this was from the 1970s. Now, the, the, this is just a little wobbly, and that happens a lot with the, the riveted pieces, but it's it's still there. I don't see any marks. Um, and $5, most, most of the brooches, I believe, are going to be $5, but um, prices are varying. I have things as low as a dollar and things up to I think 10 might be the highest. But anyway, $5 with 10% off. So that is, oh, let's measure that. Approximately one and three eighths across. So got that, and that was number four. So moving on to number five. We have a slider bracelet. Now this one, I'm not sure, is marked. It has, it has an SP. Let's see. Slider bracelet SP, and a lot of those that are marked like that is Avon, and I, ha I did see this listed I believe it was $20 somewhere, and they did say it was Avon, but this is in really good condition. I mean, you can see by by the the clasp, it is, there's, there's no wear, so I don't know if this was ever worn, but it is, the enameling is, is really good. So, I'm asking $15 for the bracelet. Again, don't forget, 10% off the bat. Um, free shipping, $30 to anyone in the uh, lower U.S., and an, an additional 10% off of $50, so, and it'll all be in the description. So that was number five, $15. Number six is another Christmas tree, or not another, but a Christmas tree brooch. Number six, $5. And this one has, um, again, the green and red enameling. Um, and there's a little rhinestone in the star on the top of the tree. I guess you can see that. Um, let's take a quick. That is just under two inches. I don't know if you can see. Right around. Oh, no, you can't see that. <laughs> Sorry. Um, right under two inches. by one and a half. 
Um, maybe I shouldn't have put this in the on the cards before doing this. I might edit some of this out. So um, it has the the riveted pen bar. Um, again, I do not see any marks on this. No maker's marks. But in very good condition. So that's number six. And number seven is a Hallmark Ice Skating Snowman. And in my research, um, I believe some of these were selling for $5 as well on eBay. Most of the things that I have marked probably lower than what I found them listed for. But this is a Just a simple C closure. Um, if you can see that, it's just a C closure there. It does say, there's no date on this one. I couldn't see a date on this one. I have other ones that are marked in the 1980s, like 83 or 81, something like that. So I, they look to be similar to this, so that they might be around the same time frame. But this is a, a plastic um, material. So we've got that. That's number seven, five dollars. And here, now this one, I think this is a good price on this. <laughs> and this is a pretty brooch, but this is a Jerry's Christmas ornament brooch um, with some enameling on the raised areas. Way too close. So we've got that. It is signed, it is a signed piece. You might be, I think you can see that it says Jerry's. So, and it has the, the older bar style pen back with it's riveted on. It's in good condition. And this one, number eight, is eight dollars. But don't forget, you get that 10% right off the bat, 10% discount. So this one, number nine, this is, I'm calling this, uh, some of you may recall if you have been watching my videos, um, I purchased this and I thought it was the Grinch. <laughs> it looked like the Grinch to me, but honestly I can't find anything like it out there. Um, I've never found this exact brooch and nothing that I look up for Grinch resembles this. So I'm calling it um, Gold Tone Elf brooch. And he's like gathering up the little presents. There's um, looks like a, a bugle, some type of horn, um, package with a bow, a little sailboat. Um, and it's both the smooth and the brushed gold. This one I am asking $10. Um, no markings that I can see. Didn't catch. It's a good size. It reminds me of JJ, but it's not marked JJ. But that style, that, that whimsy that JJ normally puts out. So if you, let's see, from the tip of the toe to, I don't know if that's part of his hand, but this little spot over here, you can see that's two and a half inches. So it's a, it's a pretty substantial pen. And that's about 
one and a half tall. So again, number nine is $10. Number 10, this one is another Hallmark. This is Mark 19, um, 1983 Hallmark. I'm sorry if I'm looking away reading it off the paper, so I don't know if y'all heard that. Boy, <laughs> it's a little tight in here. Um, again, just like the snowman, $5. It has the same type of C closure. Um, and I don't know if you'll be able to tell. This one is marked 1983. Very cute, and it is it is a plastic. I don't know what type of um, plastic, but it is a plastic material. Um, so this is number ten, five dollars. We'll go on to number eleven. We have another Hallmark piece. This is Hallmark nineteen eighty one. And it is Santa Claus. And it is a brooch. Again, we've got the C closure. And this one is kind of thick, if you can see that. And it is, it is marked right in this area here. So, I don't know if this matters to anyone, but I have gently cleaned all of these pieces um, with an alcohol pad, just, you know, to disinfect. Um, it dries quickly, so, you know, there's usually no damage done to the piece. Um, just cleans it and disinfects. So all of these pieces have been wiped with uh, alcohol. Um, okay, did I say, did I give you the price on that one? This is number 11, $8. Okay, let's do a couple more. Number 12, is there are two lapel pins and they are enameled, painted enameled with like a resin coating. So I don't know if you can tell that they're very, yeah, I think you can see that they, that glaze or that resin that they put on it, it, it's, it makes it very shiny and easy to, to wipe off. And they are This one is marked Taiwan, so that is an older piece. This is, okay, they're both. I think that's why I put them together. They're both Taiwan. And $5 for both of them. So not bad, it's a pretty good deal. And that's number 12, two lapel pins, $5. Let's see, number 13. Um, it's a Santa stick pen, and I'm throwing in the candy cane brooch. So this is number 13, is $7. Oh, I always stop measuring. <laughs> if y'all need any measurements, you know. It's pretty, pretty standard. These are, these are an inch across. Santa was, it's about one and a quarter across. I'm kind of looking at this at an angle, so, but I'm thinking it's about one and a quarter. So, okay, this one, this is, um, 
This has the fold over clasp. I shouldn't have put these on the cards. <laughs> so, um, but the, the pen itself is plastic. So, um, that's, I'm throwing it in as a free gift. Yeah. Be careful. If, any, if anybody buys these, <laughs> be careful taking them off. They're kind of tight on there. So this is, you know, it's, it's a painted plastic. Rather, you know, it's thin, but it's cute. A nice little accent. And, of course, you've got your stick pen. Let me do this carefully so I don't poke myself. This one is okay. It is two and a half inches. Oh, you can't see it. Two and a half inches. So, and it is done in gold tone and it's in good condition. So it's the two pieces, number 13, seven dollars. And we don't want to stop with number 13, so let's do another one. Number 14 is Santa. Look, it's a Santa lapel pen. But you know this one's got to be, what, 80s? Early 80s? <laughs> He's got Pac-Man in his sack. <laughs> and this is that um, enameled with the resin on the top. I mean, you, you can see the shine on there. And it is a lapel pen. It's um, gold tone. And this, that wasn't coming off, so I didn't want to take the finish off. So I didn't. But it, like I said, it's been wiped down with an alcohol pad. Um, so this one, seven dollars. So this is Pac-Man with Santa, number fourteen, seven dollars. Okay, let's do one more. We'll, we'll do a fifteen lot. Oh, okay. We'll end with um, another slider bracelet. This one has a little bit of wear to it, but it also has a lot of bling. It has the red and the the red here and the green it's not showing up green there maybe you can see a little better um, rhinestones on the clasp like i said there is a little bit of wear um let's turn that around but there is some enameling and then there's rhinestones on several of the pieces rhinestones and pearls. Everything is there. Again, the enameling, the rhinestone tree, and it repeats itself around. So, again, because of the bling, even though there's a little bit of wear on it, I'm asking $15. I don't know if you can see. It's the metal has a little bit of wear. But still, still a very nice piece. Okay, well that will do it for this first video. Again, each piece is 10% off the marked price. It's free shipping to anyone in the 48 lower United States um, if you spend $30 or more. Um, if you spend $50 or more, you get an additional 10% for a total of 20% off. So just something to keep in mind if you're looking ahead to buy for Christmas. So, alrighty, well, this will be uh, video number one. We'll have um, at least one more, maybe two more videos with additional items. Um, a lot of earrings will be coming up in the next um, video. So um, I hope to see you then. Take care, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.